Hi guys. Haven't been asleep yet. Trying to rearrange my room. So I can get better lighting and have a better background. Or backdrop, whatever you want to call it. Guess what? Shani's back with her non-positive shit. And I knew it wouldn't be long. Oh, I'm going to make this all positive. Yeah, right. Okay, here she is. I know something you don't know. I know something you don't know. I know something you don't know. <laughs> I know something you don't know. I don't really fucking care. Oh, I know something you don't know. Keep it like that throughout the whole video. That'd be great. That'd be really great. Mm. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> oh, please don't. Please. It's so much easier looking at you with your hat over your face. <sighs> you guys are so going to flip out soon. What'd you do? And I'm going to laugh the whole entire time. And you're probably not going to see it. <laughs> Who cares? Anyway. anyway. I think I said what I needed to say. Yeah, it made a lot of sense. This is delicious. It's like shit. Mm. I just love Stouffer's. This is like... The Stouffer Bowls, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. The Stouffer Bowls, they are so good. This is like the meatball Stouffer Bowl. Mm -hmm. You should try it. I've had the macaroni and cheese with the fried chicken one. Also good. And then they have this roast beef one. <coughs> also very okay good. This? And then I have this like Coke Zero here. See this beauty? I recommend Coke Zero to those who are transitioning from sugar soda to non-sugar. Do the Coke Zero. It's the way to go. You know? Mm. It looks horrible. This does not look horrible. This looks like a big freaking meatball. With some mashed potatoes and some really good, like, this, like, like, really good <laughs> gravy that, like, you can taste the Worcestershire sauce. Mm. And you, and it's got mushrooms in it. It's not, like, yum. You want to check on Rev, make sure he's okay? Seems like that's all he does throughout your whole videos is cough. <laughs> Why you got a troll, troll? You know? What is your favorite color? Blue, no, green. Ah! I can't believe it's five in the morning and I haven't even thought of going to bed. You guys are probably too young to know what that means. Or where that comes from. You know? Do we care? You know, you're getting old. When everyone says I stand this shit and they actually don't know what stand means because they never listen to Eminem. Anyone who says there's stands, you don't understand the meaning of stand and where that word comes from. It comes from a little literal like stalker of Eminem. So I mean, hey, if you want to stand and be someone's stalker. Whatever, man. Diabetes? Oh, I'm sorry. I don't talk about that person on my channel. Sorry. So, you can say diabetes all you want. That's your thing. She's so fucking ugly. It's hard to look at. It really is. 
I'm sorry, but I don't like this woman at all. Ah. See, there's nothing wrong with being a big guy. Nothing wrong with that, Shane Glaze, Mr. Man. Nothing wrong with that. Does she ever brush her hair? I'd just like to know. Because it always seems like it's a mess. Well, my hip, hip hurts like hell. I've been complaining about it. We know. For the last several fucking days. We know. Unable to make a video because there's so so much pain but my good friend G-Man got me a beautiful hat and um, he also got me some uh, ibuprofen and I, I thank you and Benadryl <laughs> and I thank you good man for the ibuprofen and the Benadryl Question. If you have to lay in your bed and not be able to do anything because you're in so much pain and you can't afford ibuprofen, don't you think one of you should get out and get a job? Okay, you can get a job. I work. I'm in pain. I'm overweight. But I still do it. Yes, I can only work a couple hours a day, but guess what? I do it. What about Red? What the fuck's wrong with him? Why can't he go out and get a job? There's nothing wrong with him. Well, physically. Helps a lot. Like, a lot, a lot. Like. I suggest to anyone never get a hip injury. It's the worst feeling on the earth. If you like to take risk, okay, well, hit, hit, hurt your hip. And then, and then you'll find out. That hip pain is probably worse than back pain. That It's in my opinion. And it is your opinion because I've fallen down the steps and slid down on my left side of my butt and hip. I had a hip injury. Okay? It was bruised. And yes, it hurts. And it's still, when it gets wet or it gets cold out, it aches. I know it. But you're not the only one. And you make it sound like you're the only one who suffers with any kind of pain at all. You stupid bitch. Don't be rude. Go away. Go somewhere else. You're mean. So are you. Probably because you're overweight. You are. Yeah. And you're blocked because of your big fucking mouth. Go be critical on someone else's channel, okay, mister? Absolutely. Okay? You love the drama. I don't like critical fucking people, okay? I think you're assholes and rude. Don't be critical like me. I think you are an asshole and rude. Or, or critical like me. Don't be critical like that! Like you, I'm not you critical. said it right the yes, first time. Yes, I am. I can be critical. But I only do it for the benefit of mankind, because you motherfuckers disappoint me. Aaron. Always Aaron. saying something mean to someone. What is wrong with you? Miss Kitty, thank you for putting a hair in my mouth. You shed too much. You never learned how to be polite? I would I would I would assume yeah. that people should know. Rev in the background all the time. Yeah. How did I hurt my hip? Years of lifting people up. Yeah. <laughs> I got that osteoarthritis right in the hip. It's just taking up that ball joint of mine and just. <laughs> you like Jesus? Hurts like hell too. It is. It, it is it does. awful. It does. It hurts. A lot. Thank you, Cherokee Rose. Gavin Pycat. You're huge? That's okay, man. Big is beautiful. Yep. Not in your case. Correct. I bet the Durango incident <laughs> didn't help. No, it probably didn't. It probably made it even fucking worse, to tell you the truth. Because I, 
word. Because I, I had to go to the hospital after doing that shit. Yeah, you did. Mm. And they gave me some muscle relaxants, and I couldn't take it until I got to the house. So I had to drive all that without taking muscle relaxants, because that shit will put you fucking asleep. But I wanted to get the fuck to, you know, Pennsylvania. You know? We didn't even stop at a hotel that night, I don't think. Yeah. We did? Sven. Sven. Oh, Quinn. yeah, we did. Seven point or we did. Yeah. And, and thank God for them. Yeah. Dude! Don't be chopping on Gavin's ass like that. What is... Watermelon. I've been attacking him. Why are you... I think she sticks up for Gavin more than she does her kids. Why are you attacking Gavin like that? Don't be chomping on his ass, dude. Why the Mullins? I'm sorry, Gavin. Are you okay, baby? Beth, look at the baby. Are you okay? Get down. Get down. Gavin. You're being a naughty girl today. What's wrong with you? She's been like that. Ah, oh, man. And then yes. she's doing her watermelon warrior voice. Oh, my God. Wait a minute. Gavin is a girl? All this time I thought Gavin was a boy because Gavin sounds like a boy's name. But then again, they're the ones naming their animals. Zoomies all around the goddamn house. It's like, what the fuck? Zoomies. Fucking done. I'm fucking done being quiet. Okay? Fucking done. Go ahead. <laughs> Be loud. Be a bitch because that gives us content. <laughs> yeah. She's biting. No. Watermelon is biting Gavin on the ass. And Gavin's like, what the fuck, man? Why that's, the fuck are you doing that to that's me? That's fucking rude. Because he's. Okay, now I'm confused. Okay, so Watermelon must be the girl and Gavin is the boy, right? Is that how it goes? So maybe I was wrong. Very pacifist. <laughs> You know, once in a while, she pisses him off, and he swipes her, though. It's like, you know what? He's very patient with you, Watermelon, and your freaking antics. Okay, so Gavin is a boy, and Watermelon is a girl. And Watermelon is a weird name for a cat. You know, he's just lying down on the bed in front of the heater, chilling out. And you know what she does? You know what she does, Watermelon? She goes and starts whacking with his tail, and he looks behind, and he's like, okay... I'll, 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 you know, I'll let you do it for a while and then smack right in the middle of her forehead. There goes his paw, like, stop it. And she's like, and then she boops off with her little watermelon noise. True story. Uh, uh, Did anybody notice that tooth? Doesn't it seem like it's going to come out one of these days? Oh, God, stop. <laughs> Who's my favorite YouTuber? Oh God, I got I have so many though. I don't like to pick and choose people. I don't. I Brush don't. Your hair. I, I your you know. Hair. They've never seen such a big guy. Okay, dude. It's like stop obsessing about your looks. No one cares. Uh, his face healing for your fibro. She's laying on pause. <laughs> oh my god. So, this is her idea of being presentable for a video, putting a hat on to cover her probably greasy hair, and she doesn't comb it. Puts a little bit of eyeshadow on and thinks she's presentable. <laughs> the laying of the paws. You're healed, Gavin. Now let me chomp on your asshole. Asshole. <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. The hole in the ass. She's been going crazy lately. I don't know what's going on with her. She must be going through like some like. She's like around that age, like in cat years, I guess. Like she's like. 18, 19, so she doesn't really know what the fuck she wants with, to do with her life. So she's, like, going through this phase of being very kitten-like to, like, being a full-out bitch. No. It's pretty much how my life went. I went from very being very kitten-cute, like, I love the world, and then I uh. got jaded, and then I became a bitch. 
and everyone started hating me and I didn't know what the fuck to do. It's like, what the fuck do you do? Okay, let me try to be silent. You know, let me not talk to these fucking people, you know, ignore them and shit. And I, I'm, I'm like very, very sad over it. You know, I'm very sad over it because it's like, why can't people forgive me over the shit I do? Because, you know, I've said sorry a billion fucking times to the point where I was sick of saying fucking sorry. And I shouldn't be sorry over my fucking thoughts or opinions anyway. But you keep doing it. When you beg people for money and then bitch them out for not helping you. What do you expect? Because that's all you get from me is thoughts and opinions. You know, they always like to see me backlash and shit, but they never even they never even tell why I'm backlashing. Maybe it's a million freaking messages you guys give me about what kind of human being you think I am, even though you're completely wrong because I'm nothing like the people you say I am. I'm just a flawed person with, you know, personality disorder. It's always something, Shani. It's never just yourself. It's never the way you act. It's something that's wrong with you. Okay, guys, that was my 15 minutes. Um, I'm not sure if I can keep going after 15 minutes, but I'm going to stop right now, and maybe I'll be back in part two.